Now we are adding the navigation. Therefore, we can reuse our symbols. Click on Insert, Symbol and choose Chat icon. Place it on the screen and increase the size by holding Shift and drag it up. Right click on the layer and choose Detach from Symbol so you can edit the shapes. Select both and give them a white fill. We repeat this process with the story icon. Place it on the screen and increase the size first. It shouldn't be in this folder. Detach it from a symbol. Select the three ovals and give them a white fill as well. The next thing is adding these two circles. So click O on your keyboard, start right here and while holding shift drag up a circle. Move it with the arrow keys till it has a final position. Uncheck fill and choose border. Set the thickness to 6 and the color to white. Click on this plus icon to add a shadow. The X value should be 0, the Y value should be 0 as well, the Blur should be 2 and the Spread should be 0. Make sure the Alpha is set at 30%. Move this over out of this folder and by holding ALT you can create a copy. Reduce the size to 28 and set the thickness to 2 points. Move it to its final place. Now click on this lock to unlock the layer. Click again on the eye icon to hide it. Now we select all layers except the status bar, the circles and the line. By holding command you can select several layers. Add a shadow to all of them and the values should be equal to those we just created. Now you see that all the shapes have a little shadow so you can even see the symbols when the screen is white. 